Hi, this is Leo here from Social Orange and in today's video, I am going to walk you through on the importance and the role of SEO in digital marketing. And not only, not only that, uh, we are going to look at the various aspects of uh, SEO, like what are the uh, big jargons in involved in this and what are the activities and what are the part of the activities that are involved in on-page and off-page uh, SEO. And we're going to look at uh, how everything can be achieved and i'm going to give you some of the um, you know case studies as well so make sure that you watch this video completely till the end and subscribe to my channel let's get started so what is seo so i'll just show you a, a book a definition of seo now and then i will tell you in simple form what seo means okay so let's look at the definition. SEO stands for search engine optimization and uh, which is a set of practice designed to improve the appearance and positioning of the web pages in organic search result. Because organic search results is most prominent way for people to discover and access online content. A good SEO strategy is essential for improving the quality and the quantity of the traffic uh, traffic of your website. So this is what is being conveyed by the website Moz. Moz is a very famous SEO tool that you can use for your website. And we use for a lot of our clients so make sure that you check out the link in the description and get your off day and uh, so diving di diving deep dive into the simple concept of seo is like basically you get free leads from seo campaigns so that's very easy for any business owner to understand the seo because i don't want to make it complicated so what i what i'm trying to say is you get free leads uh, through this seo campaign of course uh, when which, when i mean free leads you're not paying to google directly to get you those leads that's all so that's what i mean so now you can tell me like okay fine leo you've shown what seo is and you told in very simple words and uh, can you show me an example yes of course i would like to show it to you so here you can check out this search result so you can just see the search results of this particular search query apple iphone 11 pro okay that's what i typed and you can see the first uh, thing is that apple uh, iphone ad is been run by chroma and Chroma has some uh, very big uh, snippet based ads and also there is uh, another uh, result at the bottom uh, and uh, this is more of like organic uh, sorry organic results and the first one which says ad you can see the ad mark just left to the ad but the organic results doesn't have those marks so these are basically organic and ad so basically the first one is a ad and the, the red box and the green box is an organic result so seo helps you to rank in the inside the green box on top of the first page of google for any search query that you're targeting for so that's that's about it that's an example of uh, um, seo so that's what i showed you right now and uh, we're going to look at why seo is very important for your digital marketing campaign so basically seo provides the fundamental and base of any campaign that you do so first uh, before doing any campaign two things are very important for you one is your landing pages lead magnets and uh, the other part is your uh, crm system which collects the leads organizes it funnels it down uh, pushes them to the final conversion set so these two parts are very important whereas seo is one big part of that which is standardizing and optimizing your landing pages and product pages for a better conversion rate and uh, so for this part it's very important on top of that you perform any digital marketing campaign it will perform well but without this base it won't perform well so because you need a very good conversion based and optimized uh, seo based uh, you know landing pages or product pages or services pages according to your nature of your business without which any campaign will not work so that's the base of uh, importance of seo in any digital marketing campaign so you can say that like okay fine leo we can run ads and rank on top and instantly get results why do we need to wait and uh, see all these uh, you know 12 6 to 12 months of uh, waiting period for seo campaigns to kick in and giving results uh, but i would say like only 33 percent of these clicks are being uh, you know grabbed by taken by this uh, ad ad uh, uh, um, ads the rest of the 66 percent is divided among the top three or four uh, search results on the organic part so basically you are missing out uh, a lot of new people understanding and finding your brand to be more valuable than your competitors so basically uh, we have to uh, have a very uh, core understanding on um, seo uh, to perform in any seo campaign because it takes patience so that's the base of this uh, 
SEO. First, I will just give you a basic example here, like a difference between basically an SEO and an SEM campaign. SEM is nothing but a search engine marketing campaign. So for example, I'll just show you an image. Uh, sorry, I'll show you in my system. So basically, uh, you can see the top one that is uh, SEM, search engine marketing. So any ad is a search engine marketing and any um, organic search results at the bottom, you can see in the green color, it's a search engine optimization campaign. Okay, so the difference between them are like uh, the results. First, let's talk about results. The results starts kicking in for any SEO campaign from six to 12 months. For, S for SEM, it's very immediate and uh, the leads the leads cost of the leads will be very uh, very cheap in seo campaigns like for free like you don't pay to anybody to get your leads right so that's uh, you get a lot of free leads and for uh, sem you'll have to pay to google based on the cost per clicks so cost per click is a very big topic again i will do a separate video on that make sure that you follow this uh, channel and subscribe to it to get instant update okay and the next uh, thing is roi so basically in any SEO campaign, you get max of like 10x, 15x ROI max uh, based on the product nature, sales cycle and all of that. But uh, for your uh, uh, SEO campaign, you will get like 50x, 100x. As long as it ranks, you will get leads for, from that for sure. So for example, you spent, uh, you know, hiring a content writer, optimizing a blog page and your blog is ranking for a particular keyword and you get like uh, yearly 100 leads out of that and this is like less competition and that 100 leads is not going to stop it's going to flow through continuously so that's that's putting you like more of like a 50x roi uh, on your uh, seo campaign so that's very important on that uh, like i like i told you the uh, seo has uh, two two different uh, parts basically one is on page and the other one is off page so off page on page has uh, on page is a set of techniques that you perform on your own uh, uh, website which you have full access to off page is a technique that you deploy uh, in others website like you don't have full control over it but you can just mail them reach out to them tell them to get, tell them to link back to your website and stuff like that so that's coming under off page so i'll put a, a slide now you can check it out uh, you will have uh, the list of activities that can be done on uh, on page and off page so the on page starts with like uh, optimizing your own website uh, titling my light uh, titles metas descriptions and uh, uh, optimizing for a particular keyword on the particular page and uh, you know doing h1 and h2 uh, tags on the blog pages so all these things come under on page i will just uh, put up the image here so you can see there are a lot of things sitemaps errors uh, 301 robot.txt search submitting it to uh, search engines all of these things and uh, for off page you have uh, another uh, list of activities which is like pr uh, forum posting article uh, marketing uh, blog posting guest posting all of that so getting uh, backlinks from other relevant domains so that those are all very important so i hope uh, i made the point very clear about uh, seo uh, the role of seo in digital marketing and what seo means in digital marketing because it's the base of digital marketing that you want to do and uh, i hope this video was informative and uh, if you want to know more about local seo please comment below your questions based on that i'll make my next video and post it on the channel thank you for watching and subscribe to my channel see you on the other video